what brought my painting into reality for Palette to Palette was uh, just, I went through a very difficult time. Uh, the last couple years of my life have been very difficult and uh, I lost some people that I cared about and went through some things that were hard and um, I kind of felt as if uh, I wanted to get creative again. I hadn't been creative in years, nine years. It was my first painting in nine years and I wanted to find that in myself again. And so I signed up for a class here at CCC. The, the first assignment was something for Palette to Palette and I had been involved with Palette to Palette since its creation many, many years ago. And so I decided to uh, just pick a picture and start painting and this is what happened. Thank you for joining us this evening. Your generosity over the past 15 Palette to Palette events has benefited our fine art students in a number of ways, including purchasing much needed studio equipment, uh, providing for student travel to Phoenix and even our dance company to go to Italy, uh, and endowing our scholarship fund for fine arts students. One of the benefits of Palette to Palette is raising money for our scholarship for fine arts majors. This past year, the CCC Foundation Board uh, decided to fully endow that fund. So now we can offer two scholarships a year to fine art majors uh, for $1,500 each. So I think if someone came to me and asked me, you know, if, if they were interested in art, what they needed to do or how they needed to pursue that, I would just recommend that they start in whatever capacity that is with drawing or found art or painting or what have you. And I think that it's extremely important to get immersed in the community because the community is so supportive of that, the art community. Um, and just being surrounded by people that appreciate it and want to see you thrive and, and are excited for you to be creating something. I think it's an honor just because I have been involved with Palette to Palette for so long. I was literally a volunteer in the first season that they did it and I worked with Alan Peterson at that time. And it was something that I thought was a great benefit to the school and it was a lot of fun and it was great to see local artists. And I've always kind of had this fuzzy dream about being a local artist. And so it's, it's, it's a great feeling and it's something to celebrate. Thank you again for joining us this evening. It's your generous support that's helped to create a vibrant, thriving arts community here at CCC and throughout our extended community in Coconino County.